Hey, what up? It's Don. Sammy Lee here. We are the Soul Brothers. What the Soul, Soul Brothers. Squad. I see you, as usual. We're gonna do another Does It Basketball. We don't really see them. No, I see them. Oh, you see them through the camera. Every one of them. Knock it off. That's dope. Knock it off, dude. That's what are you them. doing, man? Crazy, man. That's oh my God. crazy. You the dirty boys, man. Oh my God. But we have uh, another Does It Basketball. This is uh, from a hype beast shoe. <laughs> For sure. I was so sad because I was kind of fucking them, fucking them up. Yeah. This is the NMD. But you guys wanted it. By so. Adidas. Does it basketball. There you go. Um, you know, I'm quickly losing track of the NMD names. There's a lot of R... XR1. XT... R1. XT2000. Uh, you know, I don't know. Yeah. I'm lost. That This is just the NMD1? Uh, I don't know. Okay. It's the NMD1. Okay. That's what I'm calling it. Okay. Uh, does it basketball? Does it basketball is the question is and I will answer that for you in this video. But first. But first, let's start off with the freaking traction. That's a waffle. Is that, is that what we're calling it? Waffle? Yeah. The waffle traction. Yeah. Alright. Um, the rubber is actually hard. Uh, unlike, you know, the web traction on the Pure Boost. Uh, and it sticks pretty well, not gonna lie. But dust does get stuck to it, um, just like the Roshis and like free runs and shit. Um, dust does get stuck to it, so if there's dust, you do slide. But if it's a clean court, it actually sticks well. Mm. So I will give it uh, like a seven. No, I'm not even like six. Six, six or seven. That's the six. That's the six. Okay, uh, what about that cushion? I see Boost, that's a full boost. length setup, but they did put these little things on here. And they're stabilizers. Stabilizers, and I thought these were plastic when I first saw NMDs, but it's a really hard foam. It's EVA. Bro, oh, EVA. I'm gonna yeah. fucking see. I'm gonna fucking see. So, um, it's actually stabilized, and I think it's stabilized in the, um, the actually the correct places, even for basketball. Um, and the heel compression is actually really nice when I'm playing. Uh, I can't really feel the boost in the forefoot too much. I can feel it a little bit, but it uh, also helps with responsiveness. There's good impact protection. So yeah, I really, it's good. It's, mm. uh, um, it has good uh, impact protection in the heel. And then it, as you go down to the toe area, it gives you good response as you're um, running, you know, or sprinting. So um, I'm not mad. I give it like a seven or eight. All it's right. pretty, pretty damn nice. All right. What about that? Uh, what about that upper? The materials. The up. Okay, so uh, it's basically a woven kind of material. Uh, maybe like it can even be prime knit, but I don't think they classify it as prime knit. Yeah. Um, but it feels really soft. Um, and the inside is like a polyester slash neoprene material, which is very stretchy. Um, just comfort wise, walking around in it, it's very comfortable. But we're doing a does a basketball video. Yeah. So for basketball. Uh, it is super comfortable, obviously, uh, like I just said, but doing cuts and crossovers and stops and shit, um, this also ties in with support. Uh, the material just stretches like crazy, just like Ooh. in the Yeezys, and uh, your, your toe just slides out of the yeah. toe box, you yeah. know, every single time you do a crossover. And it's dangerous, you know. So uh, materials, support-wise, it's very bad. Um, but the materials are nice, I guess. Yeah. So uh, where are we gonna get them? Well, you, you know, it's more important to be stable and supported than have so, your materials feel nice on your foot. So, so for so, basketball. So just materials, I give it like a a nine. Right. And then support would be like a zero. Right. Is that good? All right. Does that make sense? I guess. Oh, right, oh, right, oh, right. All right. Um, now we'll fit. It fit. Uh, go half a size to a full size down. It fits really long. And uh, if, if it, since it's a woven, woven material, you want it to be a little tighter. You know, mm -hmm. I like it like that. So, um, yeah. And feel was good after cool. he went down half a side. Right. And then lock down. Lock down. Uh, four foot lockdown, like I just said, is not good because of that. The materials, uh, there's actually absolutely no support in them. Uh, the heel. 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 Okay, you see that? You see that? It 
Yeah, no. Okay. No, Heel no, lockdown no. is also very bad. Um, I love it when I can just slip a shoe on. Yeah. But that's not how it is for basketball because it usually is not good for a uh, heel lockdown. Mm -hmm. You know? But okay, moving on to ventilation. This shoe is pretty well ventilated. You can feel the air actually. <coughs> you can feel the air actually go through. So um, it's pretty well ventilated. It's not super hot. And moving on to. Aesthetics? Aesthetics. You, dude, you're a freaking baller if you're going to play in these, man. <laughs> you're getting all the chicks. All the lady. and All uh, the one girl. Yeah, all that one girl that's inside the gym. <laughs> exactly. Uh, I mean, she busted anyways. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, those are a dope looking shoe. Yep. I, 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 mm, you're just a dope looking shoe. Dude, I, I don't know what else to say shoe. really about that. Should I, should I weigh these bad boys? Weigh them out. All right. So this is a size uh, 7. I'm gonna say it's a 6.5. Are you sure? Yeah. Uh, what if you're wrong? No. You wanna get shocked? No. <laughs> you wanna get no. shocked? It's 8.3. Ooh. So it's not like the light, it's it's really light for a basketball shoe, but then uh, compared to like the Lunar Epics, it's not as light. No. Uh, it does feel super light on the foot though. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. So does a basketball. The traction is all right. It's a, you know the boost feels really nice, but the one thing that makes this not basketball is the support in the upper, especially in the lateral side of the toe area. It's not good, and um, I feel like if you play in these for long enough, it's gonna rip. Mm. You know, um, I saw this guy playing Yeezys, and his Yeezys ripped right over here. You saw it? Yeah. Really? So it was like some like Adidas like uh, sponsored guy oh, wow. that plays basketball. But anyways, yeah, so that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Um, and if you guys have any other suggestions for videos for Desert Basketball, leave them in the comment section below. Uggs are coming up. Ooh. Bare feet are coming up. Ooh. So, and It's about to get interesting. Interesting. And some Gucci slides. Yeah. Now we'll see, we'll see. But anyways, that's it. We'll see you guys in the next video. Later. Peace.